The U.S. on Thursday said it shot down an armed Turkish drone that was operating near its troops in Syria, the first time Washington has brought down an aircraft of a NATO ally. Here's Pentagon Press Secretary, Air Force Brigadier General Pat Ryder. U.S. commanders assessed that the UAV, which was now less than a half a kilometer from U.S. forces, to be a potential threat, and U.S. F-16 fighters subsequently shot down the UAV in self-defense uh, at approximately 1140 local time. It's important to point out that no U.S. forces were injured during the incident. We have no indication that uh, that the uh, that Turkey was intentionally targeting U.S. forces. Turkey. Uh, is one of our strongest and most valued uh, NATO allies. And that, that partnership continues and will continue. Uh, so this is certainly a regrettable incident. This video showed smoke rising from various sites thought to have been targeted by Turkey in a Kurdish-controlled region. A Turkish Defense Ministry official said the drone shot down by the coalition did not belong to the Turkish Armed Forces, without saying whose property it was. U.S. support for Kurdish forces in northern Syria has long caused tension with NATO ally Turkey, which views them as a wing of the outlawed Kurdistan Workers' Party, the group which claims Sunday's attack in Ankara near government buildings. Separately, aerial footage released by Turkey's National Intelligence Agency on Thursday showed various drone attacks on what it said were Kurdish targets in Syria. Reuters could not independently verify the claim, location, and date the videos were shot.